today I will be showing you guys my nighttime routine. Um, it's really simple to me. <laughs> I wouldn't say it's hard for her. Um, in this part of the clip, I was just tying my hair back. And I guess I was having a bad day because the hair tie broke, so I had to find a whole nother one. So for the nurse, the nurse, for the first thing I'll be using is Noxzema, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, I typically use Noxzema only at night, I don't use it in the morning because I feel like it dries my face out and I don't want to do that. I personally don't like a dry face. But I do know people who do use it in the day and the night and their skin works just as fine. It just doesn't work for me, it doesn't mean it doesn't work for you guys. all right and then the second thing that i'll be going in with is baking soda yes baking soda um i'm really trying to get rid of my hyperpigmentation hyper pigmentation from when i was young and popping pimples i didn't know much about acne um i did some research and it showed that baking soda helps i'm also going to be trying something else but by the time i try it you guys will see it but yes this is me going in with baking soda myself she been a mirror up myself no need muscle for my well okay and then the third thing will be the african black soap i typically bought this from amazon um there's a lot of places you can get it i use it for to keep my skin clear also and um to also help with those hyperpigmentation all right next thing is turmeric soap um, i recently just bought this and it does work wonders um don't believe the pimples you see on my face i'm about to be on my mother nature week real soon so that's why i have pimples coming in but this turmeric soap works very well um, I have to be consistent to see if it helps with hyperpigmentation, but I do, I do know that it helps with acne and it does brighten the skin. I didn't really look to brighten my skin, but it did help with my acne. <laughs> Once I get done drying my face with the turmeric soap, I let my face air dry. That way I'm able to put the, um, I think it's called face toner on my face. That. I let my face air dry and then I put that on my face. I'm applying that. Um, I do get wash my face and brush my teeth before I get in the shower, so I don't put moisturizer on last yet because I just feel like it's cold if I'm about to get in the shower and just stuff that messes up. So I do wait till I get out the shower to put my face moisturizer on. You guys will see that in a later clip, but right now I'm brushing my teeth and that's the hair from the shower. <laughs> two moisturizers that I used to. I used Cerve and then I used, what is that called? 
it's gonna show. I can't really think because some of y'all can just edit it and not in the way. But that's what I mean. On my face. But I always use the body gel and this specific note I use two lotions on top of the body gel and I don't know I just love the body gel that's why body feels smooth but I also love the lotions because it has the scent and it keeps my body smooth <laughs> This is the end of my night routine, and I hope you guys have a good vlogmas.